Hello everybody, this is Hossein from App Builder team and today I'm going to be talking about a couple of the new features that we are bringing to App Builder. You can always go to community.appybuilder.com to stay tuned to the latest news or visit the site appybuilder.com. Please watch the video and if you like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Alright, so let's get started. So here is the interface for App Builder. Uh, if you notice, I have created a simple project I have dropped in an image component here and assigned it as default a picture of a cat this is my uh, device actually mirroring on the screen showing you what the result is going to be I have changed dynamically the picture of the image let's go to the blocks editor so we can talk about how to uh, use these new features so if I go to the blocks editor um, you notice that I can change using the blocks the picture for example to the picture of a cat I can do a right mouse button on it and just execute and you notice that the picture has changed so nothing new you, know, you all you all know about this so let's talk about the new features so here is a couple of the blocks so if you notice let's say that I want to apply a shape and convert this to a circled image so for that we have a block called apply shape the apply shape currently takes a few different type of shapes such as octagon circle star or triangle so if I just want to change this to a circle I can execute this block so right now I'm live development and I just do uh, use the do it feature and you notice that it immediately is changed to star so let's say that now I change the picture dynamically or programmatically. So I want to change it to the picture of the Trinity from the matrix. So if I do a right mouse button on it and do it, you notice that the picture is changed, but it also has the rounded shape on it. So let's say that I want to change this to star. So I just type in star, re-invoke or execute this block. And you notice that it's a picture of it's uh, it now has been overlaid with a picture of a star if I change it back to the original image you notice that it has the picture uh, of the star over the cat so let's say that I want to uh, put an effect on this image so here I can use um, the block the new block called image effect and pass it a parameter uh, with values such as invert blue binary we currently have total of nine different effects so let's see how this actually looks like with the invert type uh, effect so I use the do it feature and you notice that it's inverted let's remove the circle okay so for to remove it I can just put something that is invalid I'm sorry the star so I just put some invalid parameter execute it and uh, the shape is actually removed from it so you can see how the invert actually looks like so let's say that I want to change this for example to sepia so I just type in sepia which is one of the valid parameters I rework the block and you notice that it's changed to sepia color I can even uh, rotate the shape so let's go back for example to um, to the uh, Trinity picture and I put I apply the star on top of it and let's rotate this image by 45 degrees you notice that uh, it takes effect the picture uh, is now rotated 95 uh, 45 degrees so these are a couple of the new features that we are bringing to the image component. Another feature that we are adding to Appy Builder is, um, let's go to the uh, designer so I can show you what I, I will be talking about. So for that I have created a simple screen with couple of the, um, with couple of components. Basically there is like uh, two buttons here and a checkbox. So let's say that I want to put some space in here so that the cancel button will be 
displayed on the far right and the checkbox will be displayed all the way down to the bottom of the screen. So for that we now have a new component called spacer. If I click on the help it says it's a lightweight component that may be used to create space or gap between the components. The spacer will not be visible in the APK. So that means uh, there's really no uh, actual visual interface to it. It's just a filler or a gap or a space. So let's just use that. So I can take the spacer and add it in between the two components. You notice that nothing is really happening here. However, if I just go and change the width, for example, to fill pattern, you'll notice that now there is a gap um, between uh, between the two components. It is visible here in the comp in the um, in the layout, but not in the actual built APK. Now I want to push this uh, checkbox all the way down to the bottom of the screen. So for that, I'm going to use another spacer component. Okay, and I'm going to put it in between these and I will for this time I will change the height of it to fill pattern. So it's going to push everything down and you notice that now there is uh, spaces between uh, these components here. So that's called the spacer component. It just has a basic default background uh, color to it. It's just again uh, something that you can change. It only shows in the layout, but not in the actual APK. So if you like it, again, you can go to community.appybuilder.com. Stay tuned to the latest news and where you can also get involved in all the discussions and everything. And uh, we have a great community that are always there to help with the questions. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give it the like. Thank you. Bye.